Okay, so I've just heard from the streets that there's a new update for F122 where they brought back features from some of the old games. So let's go and see what it's like. Okay, so I'm already seeing some new game modes here. Uh, one of them being this classics mode. Uh, that actually looks quite cool, not gonna lie. Oh, what a fantastic choice of cars there is. I'm, uh, I think I'm gonna go with the Williams. Oh my God, there's classic tracks as well. Oh my god, this is so good. Whoa, this is actually crazy. Honestly, I look at me, I feel like a prime Damon Hill right now. Okay, so there's also this scenario mode, which seems pretty cool, to be fair. Uh, right, okay, so I'm driving as the Tifi. Uh, there's just a few laps left, and all I have to do is not spin. Um, okay, how hard can that be? <gasps> okay, what is this pro season mode? Uh, oh, so it's just, it's just a full season but there's no assists and basically every setting is as difficult as possible. Um, okay, I mean, I, I can do this. Yeah, I think this would be all right, to be honest. I mean, I definitely know how to drive without any assists or literally any kind of information on my screen. Stop the cap. <laughs> oh my God, what, how did that even happen? All right, that's okay. I'll just quickly flash back. Oh, wait, what? There's no flashbacks. Um, right, okay, well, I, I guess I'll just carry on with a little bit of wing damage. Um, I don't know how much damage it is as well because there's nothing on my screen. Oh my god, okay, yeah, I'm done. I'm absolutely done with this stupid game mode. All right, so I believe the remaining features are all in career mode, so I'm gonna start a new driver career mode now. Oh wait, what is this? Oh, so I don't just choose a team to join, I actually have to do young driver test. Okay, that actually makes a lot more sense. I quite like that. All right, so I've done just a few laps in my test with Alpha Tower, so hopefully they give me a seat. Oh wait, what? Oh my god, I was too slow. Oh, this game is so sh Okay, so I've just done yet another driver test. Surely this time I've got a seat in F1. Oh, thank God. Finally. Oh, my God. All right, so I've heard there's a new feature in career mode where I can get new upgrades and parts of my car just by consistently beating my teammate. Um, all right, you know what? I've got an idea. Oh, whoops. Oh my God, I accidentally just slammed on my brakes just as my teammate was behind. Oh my God, how did that happen? Oh, whoopsies, what happened there? Oh my God, that was so weird. Nah, I never knew that, I never knew that. Oh my God, look how many upgrades we're getting. Oh my God, pole position in an Alfa Romeo. We are actually so quick right now. <laughs> wow, my teammate is really slow. What an absolute stinker. Okay, so we're pretty quick now, but we're still very far off being able to compete for a championship. However, that's okay because there is now something called a career booster DLC where I can just pay a bit of money to get a research and development boost for my career mode. Oh my god, look at us go. This is actually so pay to win. So realistic. I like it. All right, so I believe that is actually all of the new features in this very real update. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to go and quickly become world champion with Alfa Romeo. But, uh, yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.